Hey guys, Joanne here with Newegg TV. I'm here to do an overview on these Rosewell Fortress series power supplies, the 450 watt, 550 watt, and the 750 watt. It also comes in the 650 watt model. A couple of things I want to note before getting into the boxes. They are all 80 plus platinum certified, which means at 20% load, you need 90% efficiency, 50% load, 92% efficiency, and at a 100% load, 89% efficiency. And you get a seven year warranty. Some features here. Um, you get a silent 135 millimeter fan with auto speed control and it uses a high quality Japanese capacitors and here's a list of all your protections for over current, over voltage and so on. Here's a quick look at the power chart for the 650 watt power supply. Um, it is a single plus 12 volt rail and you get 54 amp as well as 648 total watts. Here's everything that comes in the box for the 450 watt power supply. We have your user manual, some cable ties, mounting screws, power cord, and here I've already unbound the cables for the power supply. It is a non-modular design and all the cables are nicely mesh sleeved so that it's easier to route them. And over here we have your 20 plus 4 pin main connector that plugs onto your motherboard, two 6 plus 2 pin PCI Express connectors, and let's see, we have your three Molex plugs, another two Molex plugs, and a floppy connector in case you need it. And we have here six SATA connectors. And finally, it's four plus four pin CPU connector. Here's a look at the power supply itself. The Fortress logo is uh, designed in such a way that even if you change your orientation, it will face upright. And over here, we have some ventilation holes for airflow, power port, power on-off switch, and your 135 millimeter uh, fan. One last thing, let's take a quick look at the power chart. It's a single plus 12 volt rail, get 37 amp and 444 total watts. Here's what comes in the box for the 550 watt power supply. You get the same accessories, but I'll just quickly go over the cabling. So you get your 20 plus four pin main connector, two six plus uh, two pin PCI Express connectors, four plus four pin CPU connector. You get your five Molex plugs and your floppy plug, as well as your six SATA connectors. Now for a quick look at the power chart. It's also a single plus 12 volt rail uh, design and you get 45 and a half amp and 546 watts. Here's what comes in the box for the 750 watt power supply. You get your accessories of course and this Velcro strap to bind your cables together which may come in handy. And let's take a look at the cables. You do get a few more than the 450 and 550 watts. So here is your 20 plus four pin main connector. You get four six plus two pin PCI Express connectors, and one four plus four pin and another eight pin uh, CPU plugs. Here we have three Molex, another two Molex and a floppy, and eight SATA connectors. Now for a quick look at the chart. It is also a single plus 12 volt rail design at 62.5 amp and 750 watts. That wraps up our overview on these Rosewall Fortress series power supplies. I'm Joanne, and if you enjoyed this video, be sure to subscribe to our New Egg YouTube channel. Thanks for watching New Egg TV, and we'll see you next time.